Hey guys, quick, quick little uh, thing, because I keep seeing this in chat, and I know I've just seen it tonight as well. So the question that I keep getting asked is, uh, how do you get viewers? How do you get popular? No, I'm not popular, okay? So, and I would not never consider myself popular. To get viewers is, there's no secret to it, but what I personally would tell you to do is get a schedule. First thing, get a schedule. Most any streamer you ask that you know knows what they're doing, they'll say get a schedule, stitch a schedule. You know, if you're gonna tell everybody you're gonna be there eight p.m. GMT Monday to Friday, then be there because they're gonna expect you there. If you go and watch uh, some TV soap in the UK, Coronation Street, now that's on uh, I don't know maybe eight o'clock as well, and that's on Monday to Friday. Now, if you went to go and watch your favorite TV program. Ah, and it wasn't on. You'd be like, whoa, whoa, why is this not on? What's going on? You know? If that keeps happening, you're going to go, you know what? I'm going to go watch it over TV. So I'm going to go watch, uh, I don't know, something else. EastEnders, whatever. Um, you know, I'm going to go on Netflix. Because what's the point? If you're not there consistently, then they're going to go somewhere else. Because I, I would, if I keep joining your stream. and I mean... Obviously, life gets in the way. Don't get me wrong. Life will get in the way. And, you know, something will happen. You need that day. You just don't feel like it. You're not positive enough. Because if you, if you don't feel positive, don't stream. Because, you know, there's nothing worse than streaming but being not yourself or miserable. Because people are there for whatever reason. But they don't want to come there. And, you know, you're just there because you might lose followers or you just might not gain any. It's just a... You know, you might as well look after yourself. Because that's really important. You need to look after yourself mentally and physically. Don't overdo yourself. Don't worry about numbers and followers in the first place. I don't. I just, I just, I play my games, which I love. It's my favourite thing. And so, and But I also love talking to people. So off the time, I kind of forget I'm playing a game and, and I'll chat to people. Which is another thing. You know, be positive and be interactive with the people that join your chat. Because they have just literally skipped past thousands of people and jumped in your channel. Now, if they jump in your channel and you're not talking, you just sat there with your pad staring at the screen. They might just go, you might be the best player in the world. And they're like, All right, well, I came here not just for the game, but I came here for a good chat. And so... Uh, you know, be there for them. They, you know, if someone comes in my chat, I get excited. I'm like, "Hello, how are you?" Because they've just said hello to me. Um, what else? So yeah, be kind to each other. Get a community that you believe in and join it, and become part of that community. You know, uh, don't go around just trying to make friends just for follows and stuff. You know, be genuine. Be in that community. Find one. I'm in the One of Us community, and it was before I joined the One of Us community, when I first started streaming, I was like, you know what, I love playing games. I I started streaming for a friend because he wanted me, he wanted to see me raiding on um, Destiny. So I said, I'll do this, and I, I enjoyed it. I thought, oh, this is cool. I like people um, wanting to see me do this, and I could talk to people, meet new people. That was great. So that's how I started. Now I didn't. I don't. If you're starting, just become popular, or be, you know, think you're gonna be rich overnight and that stuff. You're definitely doing it wrong, and either give up or change your mindset to it, because you should be doing it because you enjoy playing games, you enjoy interacting with people. Because you might not be streaming games, you can stream anything really. But be, you know, be consistent. Get a schedule. Be positive. Get in a get in a community. Like I said, I'm, one of us came along, um, and they were the community that I wanted to bring up a positive community where everyone can help each other and have a good laugh, play games together, support each other, and that's what I wanted to do. And then when one of us came along, they had the exact same mindset. So I was like, right, I'm in this. I, I have put everything I can into this community to help 
everybody out. I mean, I help out people that aren't in the community. I'm not saying I'm going to just limit myself there, but I'm there for that community, and that's what you should do. Find a community that is what you want, you know, and become that community, interact with each other, help each other. Um, the other thing is put some work into your stream. Um, you know, I've put hours and hours and hours and hours and hours and days and weeks into my stream. Now, half the time you can't see it because I also do hours and hours and hours for other people's streams. You know, helping out do their artwork and or the Q and A's that I do on the Friday, which is my day off. So that means I can't actually do any more work to my stream. But take the time out, um. To put it in. As I say, crap crap goes in, crap comes out. So, you know, work at it. Be interactive with your chat. Be respectful. Be kind. Be excited that they've come and given their time. Which time is the most precious thing you can get on this planet. So, if they're giving you the time, you, you should show how much you love them for that. Um. Yeah, and I think that's about it. So, yeah. But scheduling is definitely the thing. If you can only do two days a week, then, you know, that's your schedule. But stick to that schedule. If you can't be there, you know, you've got Twitter, Facebook. Put it in your own stream, in your own feed, that you're not going to be there. You don't have to tell them why. You can do if you want. But at the end of the day, as long as you tell them, so when they turn up, they go, oh, okay, right, I'll go elsewhere. Thank you for letting me know. Or if they don't, they could just go with their, oh, is done tonight? Okay, whatever, I'll go elsewhere. And then if that keeps happening, they go, you know what, what's the point of even following this person? Because they're never there. They keep saying they're going to be there, but they're not there. So, yeah, I hope that answers a few questions. I know it seems, a, it seems to be a bit negative, this video, but it isn't. I'm just trying to help you out. Um, I keep seeing the questions, so... That's, that's, there's no secret to it. It's just that. Okay. So good luck out there. Um, you know where to find me if you need me. I'm always in the Discord. I sleep about two, three hours a night, as most people will, you know, because, you know, when I'm not streaming, I'm helping out. Or I'm in Discord. I'm trying to keep everyone uh, from using that at everyone button. <laughs> okay. Right. So. Love you all. Have an awesome night. And uh, I will see you soon. Bye.